Yeah, from the very beginning for, for DM it was important to to show that we don't perceive DM's position as a plan B because I think this is the plan A to preserve the European project. And as such, DM uh, is in opposition and doesn't share many other ideas which come from the camp which believes that a retreat to the nation state or exiting of the Eurozone uh, could benefit uh, progressive movements or a progressive government. Uh, I think this is a, a, a dangerous illusion because, uh, you know, I was born in a country which was called Yugoslavia and we had real existing socialism in Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia was part of the big non-alignment movement. It held self-management. Uh, it had one of the strongest armies, one of the strongest diplomacies in the whole world. But you know why Yugoslavia failed? Not because of the na of the national war. Yugoslavia failed because already during the 60s and the 70s, it was integrated into the global market. So if a country such as Yugoslavia, which had self-management, which was part of the non-aligned movement, one of the biggest historical achievements of the 20th century and a huge power bloc, if Yugoslavia as such, where you had even real existing socialism for decades, couldn't succeed to be outside of the global market, I ask you how can tiny countries such as Greece or Spain succeed outside of the, of the European Union. Which doesn't mean that we are for the current status quo and the current functioning of the European Union, but we believe in radical internationalism and that only by connecting together uh, we can achieve some victories on the European level.